St. Lucia, adorned by the towering twin volcanic peaks known as the Pitons, is considered the Caribbean's reigning beauty. With its crescent-shaped beaches, charming fishing villages, lush rainforests, vibrant reefs, captivating waterfalls, geothermal wonders, and majestic mountains, St. Lucia offers a multitude of attractions. The capital city of Castries, serving as both the island's administrative center and a bustling cruise ship port, provides a vibrant glimpse into St. Lucian life. Explore its lively market, capturing moments with your camera as you admire its intriguing historic landmarks. Immerse yourself in the island's past at Morn Fortune and Pigeon Island National Park, where you can delve into the captivating history of the fierce battles fought between the French and English for control of the island. Adventure enthusiasts will discover a plethora of activity to engage in while visiting St. Lucia. Zip lining, conquering the pythons, embarking on hikes along the well-marked natural trails, horseback riding, taking sightseeing cruises, and exploring the island's active volcano are all highly sought-after experiences. The west side of St. Lucia offers exceptional diving opportunities, boasting an abundance of diverse corals, sponges, and reef fish. After indulging in all the excitement, one can unwind and rejuvenate on St. Lucia's picturesque golden beaches, sheltered by the soothing sound of swaying palm trees. Additionally, the island is a home to a therapeutic hot spring, offers visitors a chance to soak in their healing properties. To discover more captivating destinations on this enchanting island, be sure to watch our compilation of top attractions and must-do activities in St. Lucia. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe 10 Minute Travel and turn on the notification bell so you can get our weekly new videos. Number 7. The Pitons Part of the Pitons Management Area, which is listed as the UNESCO World Heritage Site, the Pitons are two towering peaks that are prominent features of St. Lucia. These unique peaks rise impressively from the ocean to great heights. The southern peak, known as Gros Pitan, reached a height of 798 meters, while the northern peak, Petit Pitan, stands at 750 meters. Formed through volcanic activity approximately 200,000 to 300,000 years ago, both the Pitons are renowned for being challenging to climb. For divers, they also offer the opportunity to explore them as underwater cliffs. However, most visitors chose to admire their picturesque beauty from a distance. If you're wondering where to enjoy the best view of the Pitons in St. Lucia, the vibrant fishing village of Sofria provides a panoramic visitor of these twin peaks. This view is particularly stunning when seen from the Tate Pole Natural Trail. Number 6. Marigot Bay Marigot Bay, located in St. Lucia, is often regarded as the most exquisite bay in the area. To fully appreciate its beauty, one must visit a viewpoint along the road that connects the main Caribbean coastal route to the bay. The surrounding hillsides are lush and descend gracefully to a picturesque beach lined with palm trees. Meanwhile, the bay's clear blue waters are adorned with bobbing yachts. Legend has it that, during a conflict with the French, the British fleet sought refuge in Margot Bay by cleverly disguising their masters with palm fronds. This deep protected harbor has become famous for its historical event. Margot Bay gained further recognition as the filming location for the 1967 movie Dr. Dolittle. This claim to fame has left an indelible mark on the names of some local establishment. To conveniently travel between the Bay and St. Lucia hotels on the opposite side, water shuttlers are available for visitors. For those looking to stay in the area, the luxurious Marigot Bay Resort in Marina offers breathtaking views of the Bay, complete with the backdrop of Verdant Hills and a multitude of yachts. Number 5. Diamond Falls Botanical Gardens the Diamond Falls area of the Sofia Estate provides three popular attractions, meticulously designed gardens, a stunning waterfall adorned with mineral deposits, and a therapeutic hot spring bath originally constructed for the soldiers of King Louis XVI of France. The gardens were carefully planted amidst coconut, cacao, mahogany, and red cedar trees showcasing shrubs and tropical flowers from various parts of the world, including orchids, heliconians, hibiscus, and antorium. The gardens were carefully planted amidst coconut, cacao, mahogany, and red cedar trees, showcasing shrubs and tropical flowers from various parts of the world, including orchids, heliconias, hibiscus, and antorium. 
Additionally, informative exhibits features local fruits and vegetables like Christophins, Soursoff, and Dashin can be found. For a nominal fee, visitors can also enjoy the relaxing outdoor pools or choose to indulge in a private bathhouses. Furthermore, a notable highlight of this historical significant state is the Old Mill restaurant, where groups of visitors are treated to a delectable Caribbean buffet. Number 4. Pigeon Island National Park Located opposite Rodney Bay, Pigeon Island National Park holds a significant historical value as one of St. Lucia's top attractions. The island served as a strategic vantage point for the British, enabling them to monitor the movement of a French troop in Martinique during their struggle for control over St. Lucia. Presently, a causeway connects the island to the mainland, allowing visitors to hike up to the lookout point and enjoy breathtaking panoramic views of the northwest coast of St. Lucia. Additionally, the island features remnants of military structures used in the battle between the French and English, an interpretation center that provides insight into the island's captivating history, a cozy restaurant, and a two pristine white sandy beaches. Access to Pigeon Island is possible by taxi or by taking a leisurely seven-minute stroll from Sandals Grande St. Lucian Resort. Number 3. Rodney Bay Situated on the northern edge of St. Lucia, specifically on Gross Islet, Rodney Bay is a bustling tourist destination. Those who adore the beach can relax on the man-made curved shoreline, and this area is also home to numerous St. Lucian resorts, eateries, and shops. When night falls, Rodney Bay Village transforms into a vibrant nightlife hotspot. Pigeon Island National Park borders the bay to the north, while Labrador Point marks its southern boundary, providing a sheltered environment. This protected bay is also a popular location for anchoring boats. The Rodney Bay Marina is renowned as one of the best equipped marinas in the Eastern Caribbean, offering a wide range of water sport activities. Majestic residents can be found scattered throughout the hills that surround the bay and the largest shopping mall in St. Lucia is located in this vicinity. Number 2. Shopping at Costris Market the vibrant market in Costris, located at the far end of Costris Harbor, offers an excellent opportunity to immerse oneself in the local lifestyle of St. Lucia. Here, you can find a wide variety of products, ranging from handcrafted items to locally grown fruits and vegetables. Visitors can purchase paddocks, wood carvings, spice gift baskets, banana ketchups and oils, handmade brooms, hot pepper sauce, and the usual assortment of souvenirs. Although the market is open every day, Saturdays are particularly bustling. Number 1. Alper Springs Park Scenic Drive, Mount Sophia Renamed after the sulfur previously extracted from its grounds, Mount Sophia stands as the most active geothermal region in the Lizard Antilles. A pathway stretches along a rim of 274-meter crater, enabling visitors to embark on a truly unique experience driving inside a volcano, a highlight among the many attractions in St. Lucia. Despite the fact that St. Lucia's most recent major volcanic eruption occurred approximately 40,000 years ago, this volcanic cavity continues to release sulfur into the atmosphere and host pools of water heated beyond boiling point. Observation platforms offers a vantage point to witness the bubbling pools and steaming fumaroles. Once you have explored the park, you can indulge in a rejuvenating dip in nearby therapeutic hot spring and treat yourself in a mud bath. Remember to don an old swimsuit for this adventure. Number 2. 